you're feeling like you're on overload Get the family out on the road Bring mom and dad and your sister too We got something for you to do Just don't let grandma forget the dentures Visit first class all the adventures People to meet and food to eat And friendly people that are actually greet No, you don't have to be on a diet But you get a whole lot of peace and quiet Come on! Your dog is looking like he needs a bone Thinking about running away from home Look out the window, saw the wheels are turning First class RV adventures learning We'll teach you where to go to have some fun And how to put a hot dog in a bun How's that? Ooh, yeah! Adventures. You're feeling like you're on overload. Get the family out on the road. Bring mom and dad and your sister too. We got something for you to do. Just don't let grandma forget the dentures. Visit first class, all the adventures. People to meet and food to eat. People that are actually greet. No, you don't have to be on a diet, but you get a whole lot of peace and quiet. Come on! Your dog is looking like he needs a bone. Thinking about running away from home. Look out the window, saw the wheels are turning. First class RV. So this is the entrance. Say hi. Let me see your map. So they stamped our hands with alligators. Oh, cool map. We're going to see the alligator feeding Princess Milena. Total princess. Photographer daddy. technical difficulties, a few frustrations. Yeah, we fight the human condition every day, guys, just like you. <laughs> daddy was not happy with mommy, and mommy was not happy with daddy. We are human. Oh, he's beautiful. Oh, my cousin Jenny would like this display. Let's see, make sure she watches the YouTube video. What is that down there? Down there? Hi. Hi, Mia. Oh, you're so cute, Jules. Yeah. What, yeah. you, what is it? Oh, show me. Can you please show me? Oh, wow, is that the crested fireback pheasant? Is it a monkey like you? No. It's a marmoset. Oh. Where is he at? I know. I think he's sleeping. He's right home. Oh, oh. oh 
here's another bird. It's called the plush crested jay. Oh, look at him. Oh, yeah. What, baby? These are very healthy gators. You want to get out? Okay. Show me. It's covered. Massimo. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hold on, baby. Does he have a name? Say hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> he stops for like two seconds. Yeah, baby. Yeah. The turtles. Wow, there's. Look at that. Hey, look. Oh, that's beautiful. I think that Like you're on overload. Get the family out on the road. Bring mom and dad and your sister too. We got something for you to do. Just don't let grandma forget the dentures. Visit first class all the adventures. People to meet and food to eat and friendly people that are actually greet. No, you don't. whole lot of peace and quiet come on your dog is looking like he needs a bone thinking about running away from home look out the window saw the wheels are turning first class rv adventures learning we'll teach you where to go to have some fun and how to put a hot dog in a bun how's that Ooh, yeah Civilizations, vultures were symbols of strength, honor, and power. Vultures play an important role in cleaning up after the dead, and some cultures believe that they help the dead in the afterlife. So here are some vultures. 
Wow, these are big guys. What is that noise? Galapagos tortoise. Come on. You want to see the tortoise? Wow, that's pretty. No, Mimi. Mimi, leave that alone. We are going that way. Walk. Go with Mimi. Walk, Mimi. Mimi, walk. Look at all the gators. Uh, Bye. Uh, There is so many. Wow. Guys, is this cool? Julian, show me where the crocodiles are. Look, they're feeding them. That is so cool. You see him? He's throwing food in there. They're eating. Look, ready? Where's Mimi? Mimi, you left Clifford. Whoa. <laughs> you got them really close to each other. Well, there's one close to each other. Mimi, Julian, look at mommy. <laughs> you like mommy? What's in there? Open it. Really cool 
play area. Is that cool, guys? Wow. What are you digging? You don't know. There's a few things in there. Uh, yeah, if you see two that don't look like the others, those are our, uh, Al our crocodiles, Hershey and Mary. But like I was saying, uh, we're over 120 years old, founded in 1893. Um, our original location is across the street, but in the 19... had a swollen hole. So what happens when they grab, when they grab hold of a deer? Well, they're gonna have to kill it first. Maybe drown it into water, or break its neck. And then they do it to you have to have the death roll. It's not actually how they kill it, but it's how they dismember it. This one's on a mission here. Oh, no, looks like Hershey's gonna come in. There you go. All right. So yeah, so alligators, they also do have about 70 to 80 conical shaped teeth in their mouths. And they actually go through at least 2,000 teeth in a lifetime. They replace their teeth similar to the way that we replace our baby teeth. Now usually we don't find hundreds of teeth every morning in the, the sand and filtration systems here. Get the family out on the road. Bring mom and dad and your old sister too. We got something for you to do. Just don't let grandma forget the dentures. Visit first class all the adventures. People to meet and food to eat and friendly people that are actually greet. You know, you don't have to be on a diet, but you a whole lot of peace and quiet. Come on! Your dog is looking like he needs a bone. Thinking about running away from home. Look out the window, saw the wheels are turning. First class RV adventures learning. We'll teach you where to go to have some fun. And how to put a hot dog in a bun. How's that? Yeah! That's how they get you. So, and contrary to popular belief, folks, this surprises people. They're a lot more dangerous in captivity than they are in the wild. I don't say that to make it seem more dramatic being in with them and all that. Two things. One, if you mess up here, um, alligators in the wild are afraid of people. You get this close to a wild alligator, it's long gone, right? They just take off unless they're habitually fed by people. What alligators do you see anywhere near here that are habitually fed by people? <laughs> well, this one and that one, exactly. So these animals, once they learn to associate people with food, in fact, I've been standing like in the middle of a bunch like that, dropped my radio off my belt, and all of a sudden, eight alligators from all different directions are pouring it on. And what do you do? I mean, you know, so you climb a tree or whatever. So, so that's why they associate us with food. So. Lot of peace and quiet. Come on! Your dog is looking like he needs a bone. Thinking about running away from home. Look out the window, saw the wheels are turning. First class RV adventures learning. What happened? Freddy! <laughs> the rain's gonna make you melt. Oh, it's gonna make you melt.
window? species of alligator or crocodile at one facility which i think is just insane because this is almost in my backyard i've lived in florida almost my whole life and um i, I never knew that i could just go see every species <laughs> of alligator like a couple hours away so um shout out to everyone that made this possible um the alligator farm was it was an amazing experience they have all kinds of animals they just don't have alligators even though that's the main exhibit. <laughs> yes, I know, because of the name, it kind of throws you off a little bit, but they have uh, birds from Africa display, they have uh, monkeys. The biggest I mean, vultures I've ever seen in my yes, life. The They're about Sandra's size. <laughs> they had Komodo dragon, they had um, an alligator named Gomek, and there's like a whole thing oh for him. Oh my gosh, 17 and a half foot <laughs> gator, guys. He what? passed away in like 1996, I believe, and he was on the front page of the St. Augustine newspaper because it was such a big deal. Um, that. He was huge. I also got to see um, Maximo. Maximo. And Man, I got cool. an amazing shot of yes. this guy's eyeball. It was amazing. Stay tuned for that. Well, I guess you'll see it in this video. <laughs> All right. Anything else you want to add? I'm so excited. We, we, so yeah. we had to pull up on scene. You know, we had a gator that was, you know, ah. was getting a little riled up, a little too excited. So first class RV adventure decided to pull up and um, attend the situation. Yeah. All right, guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today. It was just a fabulous day. And we hope that if you are in St. Augustine, you come to the alligator farm. You have to check it out. It is phenomenal. The kids had a blast. Our two-year-olds were great. Our four-year-olds were great. It was just awesome. Yeah, awesome. yeah. The, the kids they behaved. Yes. Ex uh, really. Um, they were excellent. good for for some reason. I don't know if it was all the gators <laughs> around or something. You know, it made them tame a little bit. But man, no, they did they really were all good. Awesome. They have a kids zone. So for those of you with small kids, they got to hang out there. They had a great time, slides, and you know some rock climbing so that was cool and they have a um what is that unlimited fountain drink so you get a cup oh, here and then you can just go keep that is filling. very unusual they and definitely for are. the grown-ups there is adult beverages too <laughs> yeah they definitely don't want to take all your money at the alligator farm they made it very reasonable yes i think the prices for admission are reasonable the drinks are reasonable everything you get a refill i mean come on guys who does that so um all right, well, make sure you come we by. Yes, farm. we will be back, and we hope that you guys stop by. And when you do, or if you have been already, make sure you comment below. And if you have not, make sure you check it out. And after you do, comment below. Let, let us know how you liked it. We'd love to hear your experience. And as always, remember, I'm Lewis. And I'm Sandra. And we're with First Class RV Adventures, where, where we, we support, support your the dreams. dreams. Bye. Feeling like you're on overload Get the family out on the road Bring mom and dad and your sister too We got something for you to do Just don't let grandma forget the dentist
adventures visit first class all the adventures people do Stand right here. Yeah.